Nick Parati, junior linebacker for the Demons, who had a ton of tackles. I think uh, the game stats had you with 16 tackles on Saturday night at Southeast at uh, UCA. Now the Demons uh, go to Southeastern trying to get that elusive first win. Let's first talk about that UCA game a little bit from the defensive standpoint. Um, you guys contained an offense that had 36 first downs the week before and had nearly 600 yards of offense. Um, what was the key to the defensive uh, effort at UCA? Um, I think it was just us playing as a unit. Uh, we were subbing in and out, so we were all staying fresh because we knew they were going to run an uh, up-tempo uh, type of game plan, and they were going to run a bunch of plays, but we were just playing together. We were gang tackling. We were all running to the ball, and uh, we were just executing the plays that Coach Day called. So I think that was uh, the key. For the defense, uh, two straight weeks of solid performances, uh, uh, giving up uh, 21 points, 24 points, and in today's game, typically that's usually good enough to win. How frustrating is it not to win, uh, having put up uh, those kind of performances? Uh, it's, it's frustrating not to win because no one likes losing. Losing sucks, but uh, it's our job to keep them out of the end zone. So, I mean, the goal of the game is to keep them at zero, but and we gave up 20, 24 points, three touchdowns. That's too much. So we got to do a better job of keeping them out of the end zone, holding them to field goals or ca causing more turnovers and just getting the ball back. What are some of the things that uh, the defense is doing well so far? We, we're running to the ball real well, and we're gang tackling, which are signs of a good defense. Um, Coach Day is coaching us up to do that, and now this last week we've been practicing more on getting turnovers, and we got one in the game, and uh, hopefully that can translate to more and more turnovers, which will put the offense in better positions. So uh, that's, that's our keys. Very good. Uh, for you personally, obviously your first year here, uh, you're already playing a pretty primary role for this defense. Talk about how it's going for you so far. It's good. I liked it. Uh, I like coming. I like it here. Uh, the defense is fun. Playing Mike. That's what I've always played. I played it in high school and uh, at my JUCO City College. Um, yeah, I like it here. The dudes are good. It's a good defense. We're like we're coming together as a unit more and more every week. Now you go to Southeastern Louisiana. Obviously, you've never played them. Uh, it's another challenging road game in the conference. Um, what do you see as the essential parts of a Demon victory this Saturday? playing together, just keep doing what we were doing. Uh, against Incarnate Word here, we were fighting, and last week we were fighting, so we just got to keep fighting and uh, just, yeah, keep fighting, and, uh, and it'll pay off eventually. All right, now you're from California. Yep. This is uh, your first trip to South Louisiana. Yeah. Any uh, preconceived notions of South Louisiana? I went to New Orleans for Mardi Gras, so I know it's, it's fun down there, but uh, my family's going to come out, they're going to enjoy it, so it's, it's going to be a good experience. All right, um, they play in Strawberry Stadium, they're considered one of the strawberry capitals of the world. Uh, How do you feel about strawberries? I, I like strawberries. I didn't know they were the strawberry capital. I thought that was a California fruit, <laughs> so I don't know. Ooh, well, maybe we can get you a ham and strawberry and compare it to a California strawberry. <laughs> yeah. Check back with you next week. Yeah. Thanks, Nick. Thank you.